Let's talk about when your iPod is not syncing with your iTunes. There's a um, couple of different reasons that this kind of stuff can happen and we're going to get into the uh, different reasons. Your software could be out of date or there could be a problem between the USB and your computer. Now one of the things that I like to try is to unplug the iPod's USB from the computer, uh, reboot the computer when the computer is completely rebooted plug the USB back into the uh, computer see if it syncs up with the iPod if that doesn't work the um, next thing that I would do is actually go to the iPod and select the restore to factory defaults function on the iPod that's gonna get it back to the original factory um, defaults the only um, drawback to this is that you're gonna lose all the music on your iPod Anyway, you should have a copy of most of that music on your computer's, um, you know, My Music folder. Another reason that I see the uh, iPod won't sync with the iTunes is oftentimes when we have security set up on our computer, you might have the proper permission. You know, your username might have the proper permission to access the uh, music files, but those music files might have restricted permissions for other users so the way that you would fix that is to open up the access of these files I've experienced this you know on one occasion where I changed the permissions on on the uh, file to just regular permissions and iTunes did sync up with my music that was you know the problem so I've seen that before um, another thing that happens is that you always need to download the latest copy of iTunes if you're stuck with an older copy and you know there was other updates on your computer and conflicts that can cause a problem be sure to visit our site pcfix411.com to read the article iPod won't sync with iTunes also make sure that you participate in our forums